So today I'm going to show you how I execute subtractive EQing in my mix process. And subtractive EQ is just what the name implies. I'm subtracting frequencies, not adding any. So we're going to feature the Sonics Oxford EQ with the GML mod. What I'm going to do to set it up is I'm going to boost all my cues to 100%, which would make them the most narrow cue, and then take my gain and turn that all the way up on each band. And to determine what frequencies I'd like to remove, I'm just going to sweep the frequency knob with the gain and the cue up. And this will help me quickly and accurately pinpoint the areas I want to remove. So let's check it on the overhead mics. So it sounds like there's a lot more clarity in the overheads. Let's bypass the EQ in and out while we're taking a listen. So now let's check it out on the whole drum set. So we added no highs and no lows. We just carved out some clarity in the mid-range and it gave us some low-end definition and high-end extension. So check out the next video and we'll apply subtractive EQ to an entire mix.